is Mary Shawiti. Tonight we start our bulletin with sad news where 14 Kenyans have lost their lives over the last 24 hours in two separate road accidents. Seven people died today in Nakuru, while seven others died last night in Kericho. The rising number of deaths on the roads is alarming, given more than 1,200 people have died since January 1st, compared to the same period last year where 1,100 lives were lost. Ken Gashohi starts our bulletin with the worrying trend of road accidents that continue to kill and maim Kenyans. A mother's cry in pain. Selena Kemunto mourning the death of her firstborn and lastborn sons, Godfrey Omocha and Jora Matandi, after viewing their bodies. <laughs> the two aged 34 and 21, respectively, were the driver and conductor of the ill fated Matatu, involved in an accident Tuesday morning at the Ngata Black Spot along the Nakuru Eldoret Highway, killing seven people on the spot. <laughs> This woman who is the only survivor sustained serious injuries but lost her two children and sister. Families identified six of the bodies at the Nakuru Annex Mochari. The driver of the trailer and his assistant are still at large. Gari hili la kubeba abiria PSV matatu ilikuwa inarekea upande wa Eldoret kutoka Nakuru na ilikuwa katika accelerating lane na lori imbaye ilikuwa inatoka upande wa Eldoret kuelekea Nakuru na ayo pia ikaingia kwa hiyo lane ambapo tunashuku ilikuwa inawa, inataka kuovertake a few meters from today's scene is the spot where two trailers and a pro box collided on Sunday, leading to the death of one person, a brother to Joseph Muhia. Days later, the wrecked trailer is still blocking a section of the highway, endangering the lives of other road users. the <laughs> spot. Na probox yake ikaisha kapsa. So tunikuwa na ulizi ya serikali. Wanataka damage zinafanyika hapo ngata kama ngapi. Kwa sababu hapo pa mahali kama wanajua ni hot spot. Wanini hawajai kupa identify vizuri. Kuna gari hapo. Imearibika kanta. Saa kijana aliyona. Kuovateki hivi. Ashike raini. Tulera na inatoka juu. Monday evening, six people perished on the spot at Dukamoja area in Kericho County after the vehicle they were traveling in a Toyota Probox collided with a trailer. The number of fatalities in the accident rose to seven after one of the survivors died today while being referred for specialized treatment in Eldoret. It went head on with a trailer, losing control, and it killed almost seven people. I think myself plus the police officers which around, we managed to count like um, seven bodies, seven bodies, and we managed to take one survivor to the hospital. With the government and concerned state agencies being urged to act following the rising incidents of road carnage, Kenyans too have been challenged to exercise extra caution while on the roads during this rainy season. Damu ya wa Kenya imemogika ni nyingi. Tunakuomba isimamishwe. Murko men hatoshi mboga kwa kazi hiyo. Arudi kisiasa na tusuwa ito leo ma minister kwa siyasa. Tunahomba kwa amani. Tunahomba serikali ni ukweli tunalia. We are losing our people. Wawa wanatumia chopa kuenda juu. Tunahomba hasa huu wakati wa mvua. Abiria uh, madreva wawe waangalifu kwa barabara. Waache over speeding na pia kuangalia uharifu sana. Sheria sa barabara. Ken Gashuhi, KTN News. And in response to the rising cases of road accidents,